With the threat of severe weather, emergency management officials are urging people to stay up and aware as storms roll in during the early morning hours. In the Shoals, families still recovering from the historic flooding are now bracing again just a month and a half later. Wait 31's Breck and Terry joins us live in Colbert County, where flooding victims are now on edge about this latest weather threat. Brecken. I'm here on Cassie Davis Street where multiple families had to be evacuated from their homes because of flooding. Now they tell me that they're worried about this severe weather rolling throughout the valley this weekend. Janet Bonner's parents live on Cassie Davis Street and this is what it looked like back during February's floods. Well, it made it to like the first two steps of their house. It didn't go in their house, but they still was unable to get out. Bonner says she comes by every day to check on her parents. She says you can still see where the water was standing, but things have slightly gotten back to normal on Cassie Davis Street. It just recently went away, and I hear that it's about to come back, so we're just hoping it don't flood us like it did the first time. Colbert County Emergency Management Director Mike Melton tells us he's concerned about the timing of severe weather rolling through the shoals because most people will be asleep. Because of this, he's urging people to stay up and watch the weather. I'll stay up and watch it, and if I hear anywhere towards the leading area, I'm, I, I have to evacuate my parents. Melton said people need to have a plan in place before the weather hits. Bonner tells us she knows exactly how to get to her closest storm shelter. Pins and needles with my kids and my parents. I mean, first sorry we here, mom, dad, come on, we'll be together. Now, Colbert County emergency management officials tell us that they have cleaned out all 27 of their community storm shelters. Those shelters will open up if wind speeds reach above 35 miles per hour or if we go under a tornado. Watch. Live in Leeton, Breck and Terry, Way 31 News.